What's up everyone welcome back to another video and this video I'm going to talk about how to fix Wi-Fi is missing on your Windows 11 and how we can fix this app. So let me directly get into a step. So the first one is all about if the Wi-Fi is over here on the tray is missing this is what you have to do. So first one just go over here you can right click and directly navigate to the device manager or you can just go over here search for the device manager and you can get into the device man manager as well. Now from here you have to expand this and from here as you can see we have various options and you have to navigate to the network adapters and you have to expand this. So from here you will be able to find the various details over here and for me as you can see the Realtek RTL8 192E U wireless is my wireless driver over here. So for example the first thing if sometimes you know, it might be here but it's not visible over here in the tray it might be accidentally disabled so you have to cross it whether you are able to find any kind of plus icon here which means it is disabled so i don't find it so what you need to just go over here make sure that it is enabled so as you can see right now i'm having the disabled device which means it is already enabled this is what you have to do just cross check whether your wi-fi driver is disabled or not and once afterwards you're done with this one the next one you can just go over here in the network after trying with this go to the network adapters right click over here and go for the scan for changes then you have to check whether it is visible or not because sometimes even after trying this but for some users their adapters is not at all here visible so if that is the case just click on the scan for hardware change and you have to check Apparently, if that is not working, just go over here at the top, click on the action. Now go for the scan for hardware changes once again and you have to check whether it is visible or not. Most probably trying the, these three steps, it might be visible here. After trying this, if it's not there, you have to close everything over here. Search for the settings and you have to click on the settings. And right now from here, what you need just go over here, click on the network and internet. And right now you can see if you scroll down, there is an option called advanced network settings. Now from here, if you scroll down, there is a network reset. You have to try a network reset or you have to most probably after that do a restart, then you have to check the issue might be fixed. And this is what you have to do. And I hope this quick video is helpful. See you soon in the next video. Peace out. Bye bye.